Look at my hair. I'm a scumbag. I'm a mess for you. morning guys happy monday it is february 6th I think. february child it is march 7th okay uh yeah so let's start this off right if you are new hey girl welcome and if you are a returning subscriber thanks for tuning back in so let me put this down um it's monday morning 7 26 i'm just leaving the gym um i need to take a shower and prepare for work um, I'm also about to water Princess because Princess needs some love. So I'm about to water her before I take a shower. Um, did I show y'all my bar cart? I'm pressed. Oh, you pressed. Ah, so cute. Anyways, yeah, Princess needs some love. So... She's a little dry. And I need to find a pot for her. Because this is looking real ghetto. But she's growing. Slowly but surely. I have the um, the blinds open right here so she can get some sun today. So let me go ahead and get her some water. Y'all like my toes. I got the the Frenchies this time but um yeah I'm tired I need to actually oh it's 7 30 already um I have something really big this week that I am I'm not nervous I'm just ready to like um, I'm ready for it to be over with and I want to be as prepared as possible so that's coming up on Thursday I'm not going to say what it is right now but, you know, if it works out, then I will let you know, you guys know. <laughs> if it did, if it doesn't, I, prob I probably still will let y'all know. So, yeah, this week I'm in preparation mode for that. Um, I'm tired. So, yeah, y'all, that's what I got going on. I have to open this mail, take a shower. Hurry up at this dough for work, and I will see you guys maybe later today. Or who is this? Yeah, I'll see y'all later today or um, tomorrow. But have a good week, boy. Ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Y'all, I got caught in the rain. Look at my hair. <laughs> I'm fucked. Oh my gosh. I can't. Now y'all know me. Out of all people. The hair protector queen. Look at my hair. So now I'm going to put it in a ponytail. In a bun. I don't know, but <sighs> I'm gonna leave and I'm gonna come back. That's what I'm gonna do. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, welcome back to Tuesday. <laughs> 
It's not another vlog because I've already started this vlog. But it is Tuesday. I just got home. Um, it is 7.16. I am about to prep for a social media consultation. So um, someone wrote me on Instagram and asked if I would help with their social media promo for um, something that they are gonna do. So I'm super excited um, about being able to share what I know and have learned um, through, um, through my experience with social media. And yeah, so I am about to actually um, fix me an acai bowl. I have 12, 13 minutes. Yeah, I have 13 minutes and we're gonna do it on um, FaceTime. So I'm gonna fix me an acai bowl really quick. I'll show you guys what I have for it. I got the acai super fruit pack. Of course, Nutella. I got this thing of fruit. It has mango, pineapple, blueberries, and um, blackberries and strawberries. Yes. So I got that. I also have some granola. This was the cheapest one I could find in Publix. Food is so expensive. Like this inflation is unreal. I literally just paid $4.19 for gas. Ain't no way. Um, but yeah, this is, who is this by? Nature. It is the vanilla almond agave granola. So I got this and let me really quickly just hurry up and get this started. So I said that I was gonna come back on camera yesterday, but y'all, let's talk about it. My, um, I got caught in the rain yesterday. I was at Publix and it just began to pour down. I was not prepared. My hair was down. It was just a mess. So, sorry, I'm trying to do two things at once. But yeah, y'all, my hair was, my hair got rained on. I would probably post the um, reel and TikTok that I did to show you guys what my hair looked like. Actually, I think I, I think I already showed y'all. Ain't no fucking way, boy. Boy, ain't no 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 way, boy. <laughs> but. Yeah, that's what happened to me. So, my hairstylist um, said that she'll, she'll do my hair tomorrow. So, I'm going to go there after work. I haven't decided if I want her to take the micro links out completely because I switch up my hair a lot. And the fact that I was not able to... This is too... It's too frozen. I'm going to put it in the microwave for like two seconds. Okay, maybe not. I ain't gonna do that. Um, but y'all know I switch up my hair often, often, and for me to not be able to do that, I was just, I didn't like that. So I had to put heat on my hair and blow dry it in order for it to kind of match with the, um, with the, extensions so with that being said i get my hair done tomorrow i don't know if i'm gonna ask her to take these out or to just or if i'm able to just you know be more prepared the next time oh there's raspberries in here too this little bowl was nine dollars Almost ten dollars. Was it? Oh no. 
close enough. It was 818. But um let me get a little pineapple in here too, child. I really wanted to be a fat ass tonight, but I decided against it. But anyways, I'm gonna prepare my heart and my mind for this consultation and uh, pray for me that it goes well and that the information that I'm gonna give her will be helpful and useful to her in the future. So, I heard I got eight minutes. I think that was all. That gonna look kind of good, but yeah, I think that was all. So let me eat this, do the call, and um, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. <laughs> okay, cool. I love the idea of using both the radio show and your art to kind of tell the same story, just in different forms. I love that. Hey guys, so. The call was not on FaceTime, um, as I thought it was gonna be, but um, it went well. I was able to drop some, what the heck? I was able to drop some um, some gems, which I think that um, is gonna help her grow her, her page. And I took a screenshot of her following now, so I'll be able to keep up with like, um, what she's doing, you know, and the tools that I've given her to um, just keep track of the progress and to, um, yeah, to keep track of the progress. I don't know why I'm trying to say anything else. But anyways, y'all, it's 824. I don't feel like cooking, but I'm going to cook, so I won't have to um, keep eating out for lunch. So that's all. I'm finally off of work today. It's 8.24. The call was, let me see, 48 minutes. So I'm tired, gonna go to the gym in the morning, but today was a great day. We got a lot done. Ready to get my hair done tomorrow. Cause baby, I'm looking a hot mess, but yeah, I'm rambling. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Good night. Hey y'all, happy Wednesday. So, running behind. It's 7.43. Um, I just finished a quick workout. So y'all, laid my clothes out and everything for the gym and still miss the gym. It was raining so hard last night. Um, and I'm, I'm gonna blame it on that because I was knocked out and I was so tired. Yesterday was such a long day. But anyways, um, I'm about to put my lunch in this plastic bag. Y'all, why black people got a whole lunch box, but would rather put it in a plastic bag? That's me. So I'm getting that. I also have, I didn't drink this um, this morning, so I'm going to drink this on the way to work. And I'm going to sit this here so I won't forget it. Um, I told y'all I have a hair appointment today and it's going to be raining. So before I leave the shop, I'm going to take all my bonnets because I'm not playing this, this time Where my bonnets at. I'm going to make sure I take, I'm going to take this big head scarf. My other bonnet in. I think it's two in here. 
gonna take this and put it in my purse because I'm not getting my hair wet no more. Like, it's time out for that. <laughs> but um, I just wanted to say good morning, Mr. Jim. So I did a, a workout um, in the house and I'm about to take a shower, prepare for work. So I'm gonna holler at y'all later. And um, yeah, have a good day. Hey y'all, it's me. It is still Wednesday. Um, so I decided to go not back to the gym because I missed it this morning. Um, and as you guys saw, I did try to work out a little bit at home. But I decided to go to the gym when I got off work. So I just came back from there. And I'm going to make me an, um, an acai bowl. So I'm going to wash my hands first. But I remember telling y'all I had a hair appointment today. It has been rescheduled for tomorrow morning. So I actually took tomorrow off just because I have something that I want to focus on um, tomorrow. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the gym in the morning. If I can get that out of the way, I'm going to go to my hair appointment. And then... Um, yeah, do what I gotta do that afternoon. How are y'all doing? How's y'all's week? Talk to me. Um, I feel like it was something else I needed to tell you guys, but I can't think of it right now. When y'all make acai bowls, do you put granola on the top or bottom? I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna put this on the bottom this time. I y'all. Did I tell y'all? Did I tell y'all how tired I was yesterday? Like last night? I was a mess. I'm gonna blame it on the rain because that rain was coming down so good. Y'all, I love granola so. I'm just gonna put extra in there. But yeah, that rain was coming out so good. I don't even remember going to sleep. Like, I just remember getting in bed. At that point, I feel like I need to put this in the microwave. At that point, it was over with. I got what you want. I got what you need. Hold on, y'all. Get my shoes off. I don't know why, but every once in a while, I have to like flip the switch on the breaker because my microwave just stopped. Like it'll go black. I don't know what's up with that. Is it my fault? I don't know. Get my Nutella. I love Nutella, y'all. I actually want some real food, but I'm trying to be a, a good girl, so. Oh, come on. What's it, Edge? Can y'all see? Oh, y'all can't see me. Then I don't be knowing. I think I locked it, y'all. I don't be. What did I do? I was holding this down. Do y'all okay? See, I'm trying to add 30 seconds. I'm getting annoyed. Lock controls hold three seconds. I mean, it's locked. So let me turn it off. Unlock. Now. I'm getting pissed. I'm getting pissed. I'm getting pissed. Okay, what else can I do? Let's hold this down.
Um, I really don't know what else to do because just holding down this is gonna lock it. All right, I guess I won't. I was just trying to thaw this out just a little bit. So I can put it on top of my granola, but it don't want to work with me. But this is the fruit. Fruit was so good last night. But um, anyways, I just wanted to come on here and tell y'all that I went to the gym um, and I had a good workout. But I'm sleepy, and um, I'm gonna wait for this acai pack to thaw out a little bit. I'm gonna make my bowl. I probably show y'all, um, and then I'm gonna go to sleep. So, good night, y'all. See y'all tomorrow. Monday, I know I told you guys I'm doing March Madness, so I have a video coming out every day. Hey, y'all. Happy Thursday. It's March 10th. I am headed to my hair appointment. appointment it's 10 21 um got pushed back but it's okay um i went to the gym this morning got it out got that out of the way so i have completed three days this week working out i may or may not go to the gym in the morning i don't know i need to complete four days but um Y'all know, listen, when I get my hair done, I don't want to be wanting to do nothing that's going to cause me to sweat. I may do a, like, in the house workout in the morning on my mat. Tomorrow is leg day. So I don't feel like, I don't know. I'll try to look up some, like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to sweat. I know that. But, um, yes. Yeah. So I was. So I was thinking earlier, um, I know earlier in the vlog I had told you guys that I had a big week this week and that I didn't want to tell you guys about it, but on second thought, I do because if I, if I want to be the influencer that I am, I have to fill you guys in on both good and, and this is not bad, but you know, on pretty much a lot that I'm um, experiencing. So, without further ado, basically I have been looking for a job. Um, let's back it up. So, last year I said that I wanted to quit. I said that I wanted to quit my full-time job and become a full-time um, influencer. So that would be um, basically making money from my YouTube, um, my brand deals, collaborations, things like that. Um, the, the hard part about that is um, consistently having that revenue coming in because I'm consistently getting bills that are due. So that's um, that was a, a big thing that I had to realize. Of course, I was going to do like other things on the side, um, like side hustles and things like that, but it didn't amount to how much I was making at my full time, uh, which isn't a lot. I mean, it's okay, but I know that I, I am meant to live a life of abundance and prosperity. And yeah, so I've been searching for jobs. I went on Indeed, filled out some applications, and I got a an email probably two weeks ago from a company and they wanted to uh, excuse me they wanted to schedule a phone interview so I had the phone interview um, that went very well I did it on my lunch break which is only 30 minutes that's ass but um, it took up my whole lunch break <laughs> but um, she really liked 
liked me. She was the um, she's the hiring manager for this company. So she was like, okay, the next steps are you fill out um, this assessment, and um, you know if that goes through, then we'll call you in for an in-person interview. So um, she. cars so basically um, I got the email for an interview so we set something up and the interview is today and I'm super excited because as I was reading and doing my research on this company it seems like a great company to work for then I would be making and I need to really do the math on this but I know it's over um, 10,000 more a year than I'm making right now. I want to say it's 15, but I want to be correct when I say that, but I'm just going to say for now, 10 plus um, thousand what I'm making a year right now. So I have been um, studying, doing my research on this because I want to go into this interview prepared. Um, and y'all, I've been studying while I've been at work. This is how much I be at work and I do not be there. I be writing down content ideas just because I know like I'm not meant to be here for a long time like there's things that I know I am capable of doing and that I look forward to doing um, full-time and being at the job being at this job is not one of them so yeah I said all that to say I have an interview today um, I've been praying I haven't told anyone this is well I told my mom and my sister but this is like my first time actually sharing it and you guys won't see it until um, this Sunday maybe I would have um, I will have heard something by then let me see what exit I think I get off basically you guys won't see this vlog until I know if I have the, um, the job or not but we're not gonna say or not because I believe life and death is in the power of the tongue. I believe in speaking positively. I believe in just setting yourself up for success and good report. So um, the Bible says to study, to show that self approved. And that's what I've been doing because I want to go in here knowing what I'm talking about want to be set apart and I want to be set so far apart that they can't deny me so um yeah that's what's going on with me this week I wanted to share that because I'm like I should tell you guys because people um I've gotten like comments and messages before that people watch me because of my rawness and just my ability to keep it a buck with y'all and not sugarcoat and not come on here and fake that's the whole reason y'all and this this is coming from nowhere but um people somebody suggested that i do like pranks and i'm like that's not this kind of channel like niggas is living real life i probably shouldn't say that but we live in real lives out here like i that's just not my my jam um I'm here to help teach and encourage and that's what I'm gonna do and because maybe doing prank videos will make my channel grow faster I don't care nothing about that I'm here for the authentic I'm here for those that need um, just somebody to relate to because life is not a joke and life is too short and I'm not saying that you know you don't have um, I'm not saying that you have to be serious all the time but that's that's just not what I'm here for and I know that's not what my channel is about so yeah I just want to throw that out there too but anyways I'm getting off of the exit I'm about to go see my mommy she doesn't know I'm coming but I'm about to go see her maybe I should bring her some she don't need no coffee um probably I may stop at a Starbucks and get her some um some coffee but um yeah I'm about to go see my baby before my hair appointment because I got like 30 minutes um Starbucks 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 where is the Starbucks I don't know 
I'll talk to y'all later. Is that right? Hi, can I have two tall um, white chocolate mochas with almond milk and caramel drizzle? Sure, and you said two of them, right? Yes. Alright, so two tall, hot white chocolate mochas with almond milk and extra caramel drizzle? Yeah. Anything else for you? Um, does that come with whipped cream in it or no? Yes. Okay, yeah, that's all. You got it. It's going to be 1353. Okay. Damn. Meet me at our spot. Let me see if I have a, a coffee, Starbucks boost on Cash App. Maybe I I do. What do you say, 1353? Hi. You said 1353? Yes. Okay, hold on one sec. And give me one moment. Thank you. Y'all, why is Starbucks so expensive? I can see if I got a Grande or a Venti. But two tolls for $13, damn. What y'all put in them coffees? Is it crack that you smoke? I need a new wallet, I mean card holder. Meet me at our spot. By the way, if you don't use the um, Cash App Boost, they have it. Like this one was 10% off any Starbucks order. Um, but let me just tell y'all what they got. They got 10% off each online purchase at Sam's. You. Yeah, you too. He was looking like he's about to charge me something. Hold on, y'all. Meet me at our spot. Ooh. Cha. But yeah, let me tell y'all what um what they got. off um no they have five percent off each postmate order xbox ten percent off one purchase shake shack earning 15 percent worth of bitcoin any coffee shop ten percent goes to bit uh, bitcoin uber eats seven percent off each order 15 percent off one order at sonic bojangles ten percent off any grocery store purchase five percent off like it's lit i use that joint every time like if it's on cash app i use that joint every 
time I go to Starbucks because like I said Starbucks is expensive but anyways um, I'm about to go take this to my mommy and go to my hair appointment I'll probably see y'all at the hair appointment but yeah I'll talk to y'all later hey guys I got my hair done I got my hair done she got her hair done she got her hair done y'all like it she washed and trimmed micro links not the bayang the bayang oh, 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 oh the bayang the bayang <laughs> i'm so excited i got my hair done it's gonna take a lot of um covering because it's supposed to rain uh, I think all weekend child let me see that's the way it goes on last train it's supposed to rain tomorrow and Saturday so yeah I'm gonna have to cover up but um it's 8 11 let me take my cookies out I want some cookies so bad to take this makeup off and just relax y'all i thought i would have been relaxing earlier but i just did a real uh I, as y'all know i work with my um hairstylist um so we just put out a reel which i think is gonna do very well um what else i did go to the interview i did go to the interview and it went really well i got a call back and she was like um i think it was the hiring something that called me but she was like you got very positive feedback and we want you to meet our director of hiring i think is her title so um that's getting set up i actually need to check my email because it may be tomorrow that i'll have to have a um a video conference call with her so yeah um i think i got the job i need this job like i just want to be able to do what i gotta do for like with the job i got now i don't know how i'm gonna pay for these trips this year on top of rent living gas the inflation of everything like i want to live a life of abundance and i know i do a lot of different stuff on the side but y'all i don't know where that money be going honestly <laughs> i don't know where it be going but um i know that i need to do better with saving money and um yeah so um they're writing in my group chat so yeah um that's what's what has happened today y'all i'm tired i'm about to take this makeup off make my cookies and go to bed tomorrow's friday um do i have i have a client saturday no i have a client sunday so um I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. I may go out with my coworkers a little later, but I'm not sure. I'll let you guys know and bring you guys along if I decide to go. But yeah, that's all. Happy Thursday. We've had a productive Thursday, um, at least. So good night, y'all. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, y'all. Happy Saturday. It is um, 11.59, so it's almost the afternoon. I am leaving choir rehearsal. Um, gotta sing at church tomorrow, but um, yeah, I'm leaving choir rehearsal. I am headed to um, do some makeup. I have two clients, shout out to Shaderka for the referral. Um, so I'm about to be two faces today and then
it is cold in Charlotte today. Um, and it was, I think it was supposed to rain today, but it's not on the forecast anymore. But I'm setting my hair for church tomorrow. Um, yeah, so I don't think I'm gonna be outside today at all. I don't like being outside, especially if I gotta sing in the morning. So yeah, that's dead. The most is probably dinner or something, but yeah. much about crave so crave it's called crave dessert bar um i was talking to my mama this morning i was like it is something about crave that i just do not like like is it i don't know how to explain it the men are there i'll say that <laughs> um but i think as far as like my drink was just okay and I always get like a strawberry margarita and that was like the worst strawberry margarita I ever had um, but they have hookah I heard their desserts are good I've never had their dessert and um, I don't like their food I can say that I don't like their food um, and I think the way because okay so supposed to be there at 8.30 last night and some of us were. I think it was just me that was the last one. But anyway, so we have been on the waiting list for like two hours. They did not see us until after 10.30, almost 11 o'clock. I believe it was 11 o'clock. And two people from our party had to leave. So it was only three of us and they sat us down. They gave us free shots on the house, which was the second round of shots on the house because we were waiting so long so um after they set us down you know they got our orders their food came out i told you i don't like their food so i didn't order any food and they got our drinks which took a minute to granted it was a friday night you know it's raining the place is like it wasn't packed but it was a good amount of people in there i just feel like we shouldn't have waited um two and a half hours and for us to have been there since 8 30 and we keep coming back to y'all asking you know where are we on the list and they they telling us that we're next but they're steadily sitting um people in front of us like bigger parties and that's what they told us they were like um we we sit bigger parties number one from a business standpoint that would make the most sense to you because you're counting on everybody from that party to order something so that's bringing more revenue to you but to have people who have been on the waiting list for a couple hours and you're telling them they're next for a two top table three top table whatever and you you have them waiting for such a long period of time and the, you can't do anything bruh what if everybody who you're sitting at this six to eight top table, what if everybody isn't ordering? Now you taking away the revenue you could have made from two to three people who gonna keep ordering from you. Shots, drinks, food, back to back, hookah, stuff like that. So I didn't appreciate that. We didn't appreciate that. Um, now, will I go back to Crave? Maybe, um, if I have reservations and if it's just like a small party, I definitely wouldn't do like more than two, three people because it was, a mess but um anyways i think i had like let me see one two three i have four drinks last night and i only paid for one when i tell y'all the africans be in there baby some africans don't play okay but anyways that doesn't matter <laughs> um yeah i just wanted to fill y'all in on how last night went it was cool um to say the least but yeah, that just wouldn't be like my go-to spot. But it was straight. Um, what else? I'm trying to think. Did I tell y'all I have an interview Monday, my last interview? And I believe I got the, the job. I feel like I did tell y'all. I don't know, but anyways, I need to stop at Tyson to get some lashes, of course, for my two clients. 
um, before I get to their house and um, I'll chop it up with y'all once I leave there. Peace. Mm. Hey y'all. Happy Saturday. It's 9.17. So, I think I talked to y'all last when I was headed to my clients. Um, that went very well. They both loved their, their makeup. And, and after that, I look so full. Sorry. <sighs> but, um, one of my flexi rods are coming down. And it ain't held no curl whatsoever. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, they both really like their makeup. So that was a win. Um, what did I do after that? I don't know who cut the arrow outside, y'all. But when I tell y'all, it is so freaking cold. So freaking cold outside. Like, I need to speak to whoever in charge because, granted, it said like 50 something, but y'all, the wind. Somebody didn't turn the wind pressure up upstairs and, and I just need to, I just want to talk because ain't no way it's that cold outside when it was just so warm on um last Thursday. That's too tight. This is, y'all it be hit or miss when I do flexi rides. Ouch, that hurt. I don't like this. That's too tight. Is it even falling the right way? I don't like that. But anyways, I'm gonna do it a little further down. But um after <clears throat> After I saw my mom, I went to Chipotle and got like some tacos and I came home because y'all, I didn't want to be out in the cold. And then secondly, I was literally tired. So I'm actually just waking up from a nap and the time changes. Um, it's springing forward tonight. So we lose an hour of sleep. And like I said, it's like nine something. So I'm actually about to listen to the songs that um we're singing tomorrow and i'm going right back to bed well I, I was on the couch at first but i'm going to bed i may go to the gym tomorrow i'm not sure my client for tomorrow canceled megan if you cancel me again i'm gonna whoop your ass <laughs> so i don't have to do makeup tomorrow um uh, but i may do something with a friend. I'm not sure. So yeah, that's all. I just wanted to fill y'all in. I may. I was about to say I may start editing this vlog, but I don't know. I feel like I have a little bit more energy, so I probably should do that. So I won't have so much to do tomorrow after church, and so I can really upload a video for y'all on Sunday, but I don't know. We'll see. You lose an hour of the night because at 2 o'clock it's actually going to be 3 o'clock. And you'll gain an hour tomorrow of sunlight. I don't want to. I'm, I'm talking about tomorrow morning. <laughs> well, how about this? Set your clock and wake up and see if it's dark. <laughs> no! Just want to say no. <laughs> I want to know now. I want to know now. Shay, all you got to do is look at your weather 
on your um, phone, it will tell you what time the sun rise and what time the sun set. Why you sitting here wrecking my goddamn gone brain? <laughs> and all these years you've been living. Because it's 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 um because it's been getting light at six thirty so. Out of all these years you've been living, how many years you seen the sun rise at seven thirty? Every year, I guess. That ain't right. Mom, you need to figure this out before the morning, morning comes. I ain't got to figure shit out. You need to figure this out before the morning comes. We'll figure it out in the morning. In the morning.